to determine the color of fruit fly eyes, two uh, ABC transporters are important. One transport scarlet pigments, one transports brown pigments. As a result of transporting both scarlet pigments and brown pigments into the fruit fly eye, the pigment of the wild type eye is a brick red. These transporters are half proteins. In other words, you need one uh, scarlet uh, pump and one white pump in order to form a functional uh, transporter, and you need one brown pump fused to a white pump to form a functional transporter. And so the white protein product is involved in each of these two channels. The other half is composed by either the scarlet gene product or the brown gene product. The fruit fly gene known as scarlet results in scarlet eyes in mutant flies. This gene scarlet, however, makes the protein for the brown pigment. In a wild type fly, which has normal alleles of the scarlet gene, the brown pigment enters the eyes, and the eyes do not look scarlet. They look brick red because of the uh, brown pigment which is added. It is only when this pump for brown pigments does not function that the fruit fly eye only has scarlet pigment in it and therefore looks scarlet. So the mutation in the scarlet gene, which results in scarlet eyes, is actually non-functional proteins for uh, the transport of the brown pigment. So flies with scarlet eyes are not able to transport brown pigment into their eyes, thus having a lighter scarlet eye. In the same way in fruit flies there is a gene known as brown. Brown-eyed uh, flies are not able to transport the scarlet pigment into their eyes. Without the scarlet pigment, the only pigment in their eyes is the brown pigment, hence the brown eyes that one sees in the mutant flies classified as brown. But once again, the gene brown actually codes for the protein which transports scarlet pigments into the eye. Only when the scarlet uh, transporter is non-functional does the eye appear brown. There are two ways for flies to have white eyes. One is that neither the brown gene nor the scarlet gene is functional. Without the brown gene, the flies are unable to transport scarlet pigments. And without the scarlet gene, the flies are un unable to transport brown pigments. Without either brown or scarlet pigments, then the eyes appear white, having neither of those two pigments. Now notice two mutations in two separate genes are needed. This is an example of gene uh, interaction. Because of these mutations in two separate genes, two transporters are non-functional. However, there is a second way of having white eyes. There is a sex-linked gene known as white. Remember that the scarlet uh, transporter is a half-transporter. It needs to interact with white in order to function. The brown transporter is a half-transporter, needing to interact with white to function. If the white gene, making this white transporter is non-functional, then neither of the uh, scarlet or brown pigment transporters will work, resulting in flies with white eyes.